Welcome to this digital learning video on asbestos awareness. By the end of this course, you will be able to name the three main types of asbestos, list the diseases caused by exposure to asbestos and understand the increased risk for smokers, list some of the likely uses and locations for asbestos products in buildings, know how to avoid the risks from asbestos, and explain the general emergency procedures should asbestos be discovered or disturbed. Asbestos is a naturally occurring material and there are three main types. Chrysotile, which is generally referred to as white asbestos. Amosite, which is brown asbestos. And crocidolite, which is referred to as blue asbestos. There are two types of structure for asbestos. Serpentine and amphiboyl. Asbestos is versatile, hard wearing, high tensile in strength, has good chemical, electrical and heat resistance and is mostly resistant to acids. The general use of asbestos is now banned. Blue and brown asbestos was banned in 1985, whilst white asbestos was banned in 1999. The ancient Greeks used asbestos for wicks in lamps as they never burnt away. The name means inextinguishable. The Greeks did note a sickness in the lungs of slaves who wove asbestos into cloth. The Romans used asbestos cloth napkins which were cleaned by throwing them into fire. Deposits of asbestos are found throughout the world such as Russia, which is the largest producer, Canada, South Africa and Australia. Asbestos is extracted by open cast mining. It is crushed, processed and refined into wool-like fibrous mass. Between the 1950s and 1980s, hundreds of building products contained asbestos. Asbestos cement products were still in use until 1999. Use of asbestos products peaked in the 60s and early 70s. 